So these are the two pajama sets that I have in my collection. Um, my Malibu Christie is wearing what I think is a mommy made fashion. I was actually talking to a fellow doll collector and I was telling him that I prefer clone and like mommy made fashions. And he said, oh, I have a bag filled of them and I don't want them. So he just gifted it to me. They were all very well made. Um, uh, most of them I sold. This was just one of the fashions that I kept. Um, her head wrap is just a floral print um, piece of fabric that came in a uh, Barbie fashion that I bought off Etsy. I think they just included it because it was floral print. Um, the shoes are vintage Barbie mules. My Hawaiian Barbie is wearing a Ken fashion and vintage Barbie glasses and shoes. Um, this is the Ken fashion that she is wearing. So it's the sleeper set number 781. I no longer collect um, Ken fashions. I don't collect Ken, but I used to collect his fashions because they were so well made. Um, and I would actually dress my dolls in them because I do prefer pants over skirts and stuff. So, um, yeah, but I sold everything else. This is the only set that I just couldn't get rid of. Her glasses are part of this fashion here, registered nurse number 991. And then the shoes are uh, part of this fashion here, Barbie Arabian Nights number 874. Let me give you a close-up of my Hawaiian Barbie. So this is her here. And then this is the fashion. This is the shirt. It does have a real pocket. Um, three faux buttons down the front. It closes with two um, metal snaps. These are the pants here. Uh, the pants have an el elastic waist, which is still, you know, it hasn't dried out. It's still really good. Um, and then the shoes are right here. They're just gold. I use them as slippers. There they are. And then like always, I keep her in these blue pantyhose. Um, they do have holes and stuff, but I just decided to keep all my dolls in uh, pantyhose because it's easier for me to get fashions, um, especially pants on. So there is that. This is my Malibu Christie. And the outfit that I bought had was like a floral print, same sort of color, um, top and I think it was shorts. So the seller just included this and yeah, I use it as the head wrap. Uh, but this is the fashion here. It's a robe, uh, waist tie, shirt, and then the pants. This is like a very thick flannel. It has real pockets here. Um, I wish that it actually had like the the belt loops, but it doesn't. Um, it is a little bit oversized, so I don't know if it was meant for Barbie, but yeah, it's still good. And then her shoes are just like vintage Barbie mules. Um, the pink ones with the glitter on the back of the heel and then the top of the toes uh, strap. Yeah, I wish, like I said, it had the hoops or the loops here, but it doesn't. So if you untie it, it just sort of falls off. Um, this is what the shirt looks like.
and none of the actual fashions had a closure so no like metal snap no velcro no hook and eye or anything um yeah like i said everything was well made and then these are the pants here i was thinking of adding a like a metal snap but you know it stays up so i don't think i would but yeah isn't that great and this is the inside of the robe and i remember when he was talking about this he said, oh, I think there's like a Ken's robe. And when I saw it, I was like, oh yeah, that might be Ken's. But then it had, we opened it because he didn't even go through it. When we opened it, we found like the shirt and the pants and we're like, oh yeah, no, that's definitely not going to fit Ken. Even though vintage Ken is very like, he's slimmer, but it just, yeah won't fit him and of course I always have them in well her in these black um, pantyhose <laughs> 